The real challenge we're facing in the emergency department is time. Sir, wake up. That's why ultrasound is such an indispensable tool, because it can give you answers at the bedside and help you make some of those critical decisions. But the truth is, for a lot of doctors, ultrasound is costing them time because it's not within reach when they need it. Sometimes you can't find it, um, it may be broken, uh, maybe not charged, or you have to plug it in. All of those things add to the time of trying to do an ultrasound in the emergency department. Ideally, doctors would carry their own ultrasound device, but a complete system costs over 20K, and that's too much for a lot of physicians, even for some hospitals that struggle with funding. But there's a new ultrasound system from a company called Butterfly Network that solves a lot of these problems. It's called Butterfly IQ, and it's designed to give you immediate answers at the point of care, to save time and to improve outcomes. The price is affordable for a clinician, a fraction of the cost of other systems, so you can buy one for yourself, or your hospital could afford to buy a fleet of devices. The IQ uses a single transducer to image the entire body, so you don't waste time changing or searching for transducers. It literally fits in your pocket, and it connects to your mobile device, so it's there when you need it. The IQ stands apart from other handheld systems because they've replaced a the traditional piezoelectric crystal with a semiconductor chip. And this allows Butterfly to dramatically reduce cost. Butterfly is also developing a HIPAA compliant cloud. This will enable any Butterfly IQ user to collaborate with colleagues or even send images to a doctor around the world. Now, I'm excited about this technology to be able to use it at the bedside to, to save time in the evaluation and treatment of my patients, uh, to be able to, to archive images securely, um, and to be able to collaborate. Um, I think it's gonna be revolutionary when it comes to ultrasound imaging in the emergency department.